Welcome to the third episode of What's to Love in St. John. I'm your host, Terri Ann Cormier with PropertyGuys.com. And the entire reason behind this uh, new series that we're starting is we want people from outside of St. John to know the people, because we believe that the people are what's to love in St. John. And with me today is Mark Hemmings with Hemmings House. Hemmings House Productions, I was going to call you Hemmings House Productions, Hemmings House Photography, all of the above. And you are the Director of Photography with Hemmings House, correct? Yes. Great. So I have been uh, following you on Instagram, Mm -hmm. following you on Facebook, and Mm -hmm. and basically all your other social media channels, and you've been traveling a lot. What have you been up to over the last uh, few months? Well, um, a lot of my work is international, Mm -hmm. so uh, clients who need photography in different countries and different cities, they'll hire me. Yeah. And uh, it's been great uh, the past 15 years or so being a photographer, um, being able to see a lot of the world and doing it on uh, someone else's money, which is fun. Yes. But uh, they, they trust my, my images and uh, that c- keeps me going and uh, it's been a, a real fun ride. So you've been, um, we were just talking earlier, you've been in photography for 17, 18 years now? I think that's that's fair assessment. Yeah. So uh, what brought you into to sort of the love of photography versus, you know, um, you know videography or, or mm-hmm. any of those other aspects of art? Why mm-hmm. photography? Well, I think the, the main thing was I was hired by UMBSJ after I graduated in 97 to go to, to Japan, actually, wow. and to uh, bring ESL students back here. Okay. And when I was in Japan for five weeks, I really discovered a love for taking pictures. And it's such a beautiful country, mm. of course, when you come back, you really feel... So that's, uh, that was my incentive. And, and I think a couple of weeks after that, I started working in the movie industry here in St. John as a stills photographer. Wow. Okay. So born in St. John or from away? I've been here all my life. You've been here all your life. Yes. And yeah. so you've traveled the world and you keep coming home. You keep coming back to St. Yeah. John. Um, what makes St. John unique, do you think? Well, um, there's a lot of things, but the nice thing is is that uh, I could pretty much live anywhere I want at this point. Yes. Uh, but I choose to live here. Um, I have two wonderful daughters. They're 8 and 11. And I love the fact that they can uh, grow up here in a safe environment, in a, in a nice environment. Yes. Um, but even if, uh, even if I was single or if my wife and I didn't have any kids, I think we would still choose to stay here. Um, it's just a very nice mix of, uh, of large and small, wonderful restaurants, uh, nice cafes, and a very easy lifestyle. I've been to very many different places mm. around the world. And, and while there's always something wonderful about these locations, um, there's also deficiencies that I really feel. And I would just, uh, when I, I come to St. John and I, I see that when you put everything into a pot, um, it levels out as a very nice place to live. Absolutely. So if uh, I was bringing a friend from, say, Toronto, and I know that uh, Hemmings House brings a lot of people from away, where's the one place, if they only had a week here, where's the one place in St. John that you would send them, whether it's for food or just you know, for recreation? What's mm-hmm. that gem of St. John that you think? Well, um, I, th- I think the nice part of St. John is the fact that we have a massive park within our city limits, and that's very rare. In fact, uh, I don't know if that exists to the extent in any other city. Um, so being able to uh, do the adventurous sports within our city limits mm. in wonderful nature is really quite extraordinary because you can bike there. Yes. Um, it's sort of like Central Park in, in New York in a sense, except we actually have more things that we can do, um, like rock climbing and, and uh, mountain biking and so on. And then on the other side, it's just so nice to you know, relax uh, at one of our cafes and meet people who who you know uh, on Saturdays and so on. Absolutely. Well, listen, I really appreciate you. I know you're um, you're a busy man, and uh, I thank you for uh, taking the time to to be on this episode. And uh, thank you, everyone, for watching. Yeah, my my pleasure.